Buford McGee and Greg Bell behind Everett. Lamone Johnson, the tight end here is Everett about to throw it. Pass is caught by Ellard. Ram touchdown. He out jumped Izell Jenkins. 39-yard touchdown pass quieted the stadium considerably. That was the thing Jim Everett was saying and John Robinson that, that no, Jim, this is the type of thing. We're going to have some bad plays. We may have a whole lot of bad plays, but the way they play defense, we're going to get some big plays. Watch Henry Ellert. He's going against Isel Jenkins here. Now Jenkins goes in front of him. You see, he takes that fight and goes for the ball in front of him. He misjudges it. And then when Ellert catches it, now he's behind. Touchdown. The Eagle 39. Everett back to throw. Sets, looks, fires up the right side for Ellert. Huh. At the 20, to the 15, to the 10, 5. Touchdown. 39 yards. Touchdown pass. That's what he wanted. Oh. Ellert. In and out. Playing the interception just didn't get there. And Ellard been ever alert, picked off the ball. The ball. Sang and hit the ground. So it'll be third and ten for the Redskins at the Philadelphia 40. Barat caught by Henry Ellard. And he'll go in for the touchdown. No penalty flags on the field. Does Farad his eighth touchdown pass this season. For Ellard, that's his first of the year. Boy, you know, you can gamble with that blitz once too often. They send Zordich the strong safety again. He almost gets there. But almost means you might get burned as a corner. He's right up the middle there. See, he got picked off. But notice there's nobody in the middle of the field. So if this ball is caught on you as a corner, you've got big, big problems. That's a, just a great job of concentration and a good throw by Gus Barat. Barat goes back, blitz is on. He ducks it, throws it deep, got it crossing to Ellen at the 20. Down to the far side, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Washington Redskins. Impressed. Third, Turner's team up 21 to 9. Breeze finds Ellen again. The 41 yard touchdown down the right sideline. Five 100 yard games and his two TDs paced the Redskins to their first win of the season at New Orleans in week two. Touchdown, Washington Redskins. Henry Ellard pulls it in. What quickness he has. Everett's 41 yard hookup with Henry Ellard iced a 45 to 31 win. A hamstring injury prevented Ellard from starting four games. Still, he turned in five 100-yard games and earned his second straight trip to the Pro Bowl. 29 to seven, with 29 seconds remaining in the half, Dieter Brock is back once again. This time it's Henry Ellard. Ellard, 43 yards and a touchdown. The Rams blow away St. Louis, 46 to 14. Dieter Brock is now the third-rated passer in the NFC. Seven on third down conversion. Looking long with nine seconds to go. It's caught by Anderson. Touchdown. Oh! Farrat. Back to pass a developing situation. He's got Henry Eller. 46 yards and a touchdown. 17-0 Washington. The first first quarter TD for Washington in 14 games. Second quarter, 7-3 skins. Cards answer with defense. NFL accomplishments. Gaining over 1,000 yards for the sixth time in his career. Says, hey, I'll clap about that, but not about this. Everett in the fourth to his favorite target. Henry Ellard, Bubba McDowell, and Marcus Robertson tackle one another, and Ellard is gone. As for Jack. A hamstring injury prevented Ellard from starting four games. Still, he turned in five 100-yard games and earned his second straight trip to the Pro Bowl.
six cards in the lead. But Schuler comes back early fourth to the veteran, Henry Ellard. He breaks the tackle and has gone 52 yards for the score. Washington goes for the two, but uh, fail. 14-12, Arizona still in the lead. Schuler back, play action, fakes, steps up, fires it deep, got a man wide open. It's Ellard, breaks the tackle at the 30, he could be gone. Ellett was the free agent find of the year by general manager Charlie Casserly and coach Norv Turner. He caught Today's game will have to do more on-the-field coaching adjustment than any game will play all year. First and ten, Los Angeles. Everett, deep post pattern, caught by Ellert. He will score, and there are no flags. Fifty-four yards. Everett to Ellard for the second time today. Just a perfectly thrown ball. Cornerback Jeremiah Castile dropping to the outside with the coverage underneath by Mike Harden. That's his responsibility. Harden must take away the deep middle. He did not do the job, and that time Everett just... Them a 54-yarder to Henry Ellard demonstrated the Rams' success in establishing a more wide-open passing game. quickly quieted to buy you faithful. Erksleben gets the snap, hits it from his 25, short. Coming under it, Ellard at his 28, up the left side, 30, 35. Ellard at the 40, 45, 50, to the 45, 40, 35, got to beat Erksleben. To the 20, to the 15, to the 10, to the 5, touchdown! 72-yard return. Seven. After Terrence Mathis' touchdown reception and Reggie Brooks' two-yard run, John Freeze finds Henry Ellard, and he gets loose reaches the end zone and just simply flips out. Go on, oh, go on with your bad self, Ellis. 73 yard score, his second longest touchdown reception in his career, TJ. People talk about route reading here. Ellert pushes the corner back, makes a nice cut underneath the safety. And then styles of three different quarterbacks. Over the middle, got it cut complete out there. 50, he's gone, it's Ellert. Second in the NFL to Jerry Rice in yards, he was lethal anywhere on the field. Touchdown, Washington Redskins, 73 yards. Once the Eagles and Rams dressed up in their eye-catching garb, it was Henry Ellard, number 80, who picked the winning door, the one that led straight to the end zone. Ellard's 80-yard punt return for a score was the fourth of his young career. The Rams went up seven to nothing and never looked back. Unfortunately, for Number 80, Henry Ellard gave Jones a lesson on how to field a kick and then what to do with it once it's firmly in your grasp. Ellard's 83-yard return put the Rams on top, 14-6. For giant punter Dave Jennings, one of the best in the league, the touchdown was embarrassing. Unfortunately for Jennings, embarrassment eventually...